In our continuing coverage, the fallout continues today in McCurtain County. Now several weeks after a local newspaper shared a recording of county officials, including the sheriff, talking about wanting to hang black people and murder reporters. Fox 23's Spencer Humphrey has been following the story closely. He went back to Idabel this morning where people had a chance to voice their frustrations to county commissioners. Normally, the McCurtain County Commissioners hold their Monday meetings in a small conference room in a building across downtown from here, but they moved their meeting today to Ida Belt City Hall for the first time since this controversy, giving enough room for everybody upset to come out and speak out. This all stems from that audio. The local paper here, the McCurtain Gazette, recorded back in March after a county commissioner's meeting. In it, you hear a commissioner, the sheriff, the jail administrator, and others lamenting the fact that they can no longer hang black people while also talking about how they'd like to murder two Gazette reporters. Now, several weeks of protests have followed since that audio came out. A commissioner resigned. So far, the sheriff, though, refuses to, despite calls from even as high as Governor Stitt. Last week, I told you the jail trust voted to put the jail administrator heard in that audio on paid leave rather than fire him. For the first time today, the commission let people voice their frustrations in a public comment session. I wanted to cry that day, and I still do, because y'all are not concerned with doing the right thing. You need to ask yourself, sit in that seat, am I leading? Or am I part of this good old boy system that we've been seeing right. for 20, 30, 40 years? This, this stuff is getting unreal because stuff is beginning to happen in the community that people are not being told about what's going on. And we're not safe. That's the bottom line. We are right. not safe. I right. trust you, but I want verification that we've got law enforcement and yes. we've got better governance yes. yes. and we've got to request it, but we've got to stand for it. Yes. Yes. Right. Yes. Now, the initial agenda put out for today's meeting back on Thursday actually uh, had some items listed on it, including uh, concerning possibly removing or requesting an independent investigation of Sheriff Kevin Clarity. That agenda, though, ended up changing on Friday, and those items were dropped. Now, around the same time as all that, Attorney General Gentner Drummond sent letters to the OSBI and Governor Stitt asking them to expand their investigations into Sheriff Clarity. Uh, his office, though, says that they did not ask the county to amend its agenda at all. Reporting in McCurtain County, covering news that matters, Spencer Humphrey, Fox 23 News.